Uh, we're going to edit this with Coral. This is the one I did earlier. Um, there's a thing called over here. You, you've got your cloning tools, and there's a smart clone which lets you take out a section. And just draw around where you want to go. And then I can take it into the next picture and try and fit it to where you want. Not just perfect, but it saves you a lot of clicking. We just hit escape, and that's it there. So I'll do that again. Still in the smart clone. Seems to be better if you do little bits at a time and then just build them up. Oh, goody, it's lost all its memory. Try and figure out where they go. It's not somewhere there. I'll escape and not release it. What I've been doing is just doing bits and then cloning in the other bits. It seems to work quite well. We can try and match them up. It's come on. It's not perfect, but use the dots as a reference. So you're on the right picture. So that two dots will line up with that two dots and that will give me quite a good reference for You just hit escape when you don't want it anymore. I'm just building up the arm bit with it. I will have to go back and uh, play about with it and blend it a bit. This saves quite a bit of time. If you can just get everything to line up. So let's have a look at JD's. Oh, he's moved. As you can see, the back here there's <laughs> quite a bit of hand missing. So what I might do is pause it and then uh, do a bit of work on it and then bring you back again. So you can see what I've done. Let's see if I love him to pause it. Um, up at the top here we've got our clone various things you can get different shapes and sizes and you can get a hardness of the brush so it fades in better I don't know what step does density seems to be work quite well about 67% thickness is 100 what you can do with this is actually if you take out a smart clone part and it's not lining up you can use this rotation feature here and turn it so it'll fit, but it's a bit finicky, but it does work. So what I'm doing now is I'm just going to try and get rid of this, or rebuild this hand here. Um, there's bits and pieces of wire. Let's do a bit at a time. Try and get the shadows to follow where they should be as well, that's part of the problem. I find the lighter colours are harder to work on. So <coughs> I've got a 15 inch brush. Let's put it down to size 8 and see if we can get rid of this bridge. You don't need to be in a hurry if you're doing this. the bridge and um, we'll go a bit bigger again. There's a square brush as well which is quite good for certain things. We'll give it a go. Just select up at the top and you can dig different hardnesses. So it's a right mouse click to select what you want to copy and then left mouse just hold it down and or just build it. Gonna have to get some texture in this as well, so man. So 
Hunt. Come back to my round one, I'll get on better on my round one. So what I might do now is go back to my smart clone and this bit's textured so we just cut about roughly it's gonna fit in there. Then we can bring it across. Get some texture. If you make a mistake you just control Z. I think there's arrows somewhere but I haven't found them yet. And it'll um, escape and that'll take it out. It's a bit dark so back to cloning again. Something lighter into it. Just copy that bit can you? Looks better if you can get some texture in it. So the texture bit there, we could bring that line over to that line. See what that looks like when I'm back a bit. Yeah, that kind of puts a crease in his uh, sleeve, so I might leave that. It's only on the screen for four tenths of a second. I've worked out, so it's nearly like it's got to be perfect, perfect. We're not hard man, we're old man. <laughs> Bring some meat into there. Let's put texture here so we can bring that over. You mess about with the brushes and the hardness and everything, it'll change what it's doing. Let's try making it harder. That's 39 instead of that. Looks a bit darker. There's a function on this, which I'll show you in a second. So basically just work away with that until I get the whole picture done. But on here also there is adjust and one step photo fix. Just covers the whole thing nice and bright. One go. So that's a short bit of what I'm playing at. Like I say, there's about 4,000 photos, so wish me luck. Bye for now.